Thanks for joining us, everyone, here on News 12. We begin tonight with more symbols of hate found in our schools. Two districts reeling from these findings. News 12's Tama Ponton has the details and what's being done to prevent this from happening again. One parent we spoke with here today in Comac, who describes himself as a proud Jewish man, says he was livid about the discovery of yet another swastika found here in his child's school. Take a listen to what he had to say. This is a direct threat. It is. It's no, you know, you don't play around with certain things. And this is nothing new. This is something I've dealt with my whole life. But to see my kids have to deal with it, it's, in, it's infuriating. Suffolk Police tell News 12 the hateful graffiti was found on a stall in the boys' bathroom here at Comac High School yesterday. They say the anti-black and anti-Jewish graffiti was etched and drawn in black marker. The discovery comes barely one week after another swastika was found in a bathroom stall here at the high school. In response to the hateful incidents, the superintendent says the district will now implement a new plan to combat anti-Semitism. The plan includes a visit from a Holocaust survivor for students. A Suffolk detective will talk with students about the consequences of hate crimes and students will visit a Holocaust museum. Our role is to educate and to hopefully to restore students to a point where they understand that what they did was was wrong and also the sort of hurt and pain that it causes to do these sorts of things. And we just learned a couple of hours ago that anti-Semitic graffiti was found on a student's desk at Smithtown High School East. Suffolk police are investigating that incident as well. At Comac High School, I'm Tama Paulton, News 12, Long Island.